Asthma is one of the most common chronic diseases in the U.S., affecting over 28 million people. But its impact varies widely among communities. Environmental and social conditions can affect how well people are able to manage their asthma. And where you live can make managing asthma much more challenging. The Asthma and Allergy Foundation of America, or AFA, studies this in its annual Asthma Capitals report. The report identifies the most challenging places to live in the U.S. when you have asthma. AFA analyzes asthma data across the U.S. and ranks the 100 largest metro areas in the lower 48 states based on asthma rates, asthma-related emergency department visits, and deaths due to asthma. This year, Detroit, Michigan tops the list as the most most challenging city to live with asthma, with higher than average asthma prevalence and a troubling number of asthma-related deaths. When you dig into the reasons behind these numbers, you start to see a bigger picture of what health truly means and that certain risk factors contribute to higher levels of asthma in some communities. Clean air, access to healthcare, affordable insurance, poverty, and even local weather are more than just environmental or social factors. They are the foundation of daily life. When access to care and services is limited or out of reach, the consequences add up. Delayed treatment, preventable emergency visits, and unnecessary hospital stays. Children lose valuable learning time when they miss school, and adults risk job stability and financial strain when they miss work. People who have affordable and accessible health care, clean air, and economic stability have a greater chance of managing and controlling their asthma. But where poverty is higher, where pollution lingers, and where care is out of reach, the results are more severe. The Asthma Capitals report shines a light on these realities to push for solutions, healthier communities, better access to care, and a fair chance for people to breathe a little easier. If you want to see how your city ranks and help your community get proactive about lung health, visit asthmacapitals.org.